Another important and very useful tool for modeling is symmetry. If you click the symmetry, it comes to the center of the software. It can symmetry objects and symmetry polygons. For example, I insert a figure here. Okay, it's very... Insert a figure here. And display line. For example, I want to uh, mirror this, for example, object or figure from this plane in this way. You can use simply, or any object, simply symmetry. The axis of the symmetry is important, that is here and our object here. You can simply click and drag and make a child of that. As you can see, symmetry of object. You can go in a <clears throat> figure and change it, and the symmetry is it's plain here. You can go into the symmetry uh, object, and here is a mirror plane. You can, it's automatically given ZY. You can hear ZY. You can see the ZY. Click on a figure, and you can rotate it, and any work, it will be mirrored that in an axis. You can change the uh, plane if you want for example the object is here the plane is uh, y and z you can change it <clears throat> other settings are for polygon symmetry okay i give an example for polygon this is very important if you want to modeling for example face body that is our symmetrical and you modeling uh, for example left of the, your face and uh, it will be symmetry and mirror in the right and connect together. For example, I have a cube here. And I want to make it editable. Before that, I want to add a uh, segment at Z. As you can see, it's here. Mm, nope. Add a add a X, I think. Yes. I want to cut this object at the middle for example if it's possible your object does not in the center but the important thing before assigning the symmetry is holding alt and then click because it's axis of the symmetry must be in the axis of the in the center axis of the object and then i make it editable I, I, i'm giving you example from that i'm going to the in point mode for example, I want to work in this area and want to mirror in that area, okay? In this case, we have to delete uh, half of the model and uh, work on the other half and with then symmetry on the other side. Going to the selection and the rectangle selection, click and drag, select all these four points and delete it. Turn off the symmetry, as you can see it is half if the symmetry will be on in this plane you have to change plane for example uh, play with them to make your plane and here is y z as you can see it's y z and it's very nice going to your cube and going to the move object and simply move it as you can see we have a symmetry call editing you can edit anything here for example going to the face change the face or using an uh, inset. And everything will be symmetry at the other side. It's very important. Okay, going to its settings. This tool will be weld the point here. Weld point. It must be ticked to welding the point after we make this <clears throat> object editable after our work. The tolerance means uh, the, the point that are at the same position or very in a small location with each other they will build, weld uh, in this range or less the symmetry call is uh, for symmetry calling the point uh, definitely tick that option is very important and we are in a modeling object as you can see if we go to this point in a point mode as you can see you can open that point in that way sorry and going to that you clamp point on the axis to avoiding that happen as you can see the locked 
and uh, automatically flip i automatically flip uh, for example in this object as you can see uh, this part was our main object for example i work in this part and going to the one to that part and continue my editing this object is symmetrical and it's not important in which part you will work so i want to turn uh, the my <clears throat> You flip my main object here or symmetric uh, call object was going there you can simply click or flip it manually or flip automatically and as you can see if you go into the cube you can simply click and flip it here you can simply flip your uh, object here as you can see okay so as you can see it flipped the uh, between or uh, original object to the flip object you can work on them as a as you can see when you change the view it's flip for you okay another important option is delete polygon on access if you select that click that object and clamp it after the clamp point on access, this option will be <clears throat> active. Going to the cube, for example, I want to work in this face, going to the face selection, select that face. <clears throat> because of the symmetry, both of them will select, going to the right click and <clears throat> inset, click and drag the other side and simply hold control and click and drag and our problem occur here this is the edge or polygon at the uh, axis you can delete that simply and my work is done now you can change it anywhere that you want okay this is an important part you can do that okay this is symmetry i give you example a simple example you can do it in a complex modeling and after that your work is finished you can make it editable and it's give you a complete and connected object to you hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release